Sarah. That's right. Alameda County seeing a 22% spike in homelessness since pre-pandemic time, since 2019. As you said, approaching 10,000 people living here on the streets of Alameda County. This is all data from the point in time survey that is released every two years normally, but it was pushed back due to the pandemic. So we have not seen a report like this in three years. So this is why we're seeing, you know, a significant an increase since 2019 of people living on the street. Now, 75% of the people have been living on the street for more than a year. Black people make up 43% of the homeless population, according to this report. The community-based organization Everyone Home releases these reports. The executive director says there are many economic factors that drive homelessness, including a resident must make $44 an hour to afford a two-bedroom apartment in Alameda County, and that's three times the minimum wage. 16% of the homeless people being surveyed say they lost their homes due to the pandemic. Maybe they lost their job or something like that. The executive director was surprised to see a 62% increase in people living in their cars. More than half of Alameda County's homeless population lives in Oakland on the streets there. That has risen 24%. Oakland Mayor Libby Schaff said this week they've made progress in housing the homeless. In fact, the number of sheltered homeless people doubled in the last three years, most likely due to more money from the state and federal governments. And speaking of funding, the county is applying for more funding for $15 million, and they're going to be applying for that money this month. So they hope to get more money and try and help those on the street. For now, I'm Sarah Stinson reporting live in Alameda County. Back to you. Okay. Thank you, Sarah. It's 509, and Caltrans